Last year was the first year we picked, we took the fruit and it was almost like postpartum when I came back the next morning, you know, cause the fruit's gone, it's all gone. You know, and you nurture them and you fuss over them and do all these things. And then all of a sudden the next day and it's all gone. I was in the middle of a hot shot career about 28, you know, right at the, probably the height of my, my playing days. And um, my brother-in-law asked me, he said, well, what are you gonna do when you get done? Knowing that you can be 40 years old and you still have a life, you know, what are you gonna do? And off the top of my head, I said, I'm gonna go back to California and raise grapes. And I never forgot I said it, it was as simple as that. This is a raw piece of land when we started, and there were trees all through here. I do a lot of the physical work myself. Um, I don't do anything without the go-ahead from, from the vine vineyard manager and from the winemaker. The vineyard manager's name is Jim Barber, and the winemaker is Thomas Brown. And I'm probably the smallest client that Jim Barber has. I'm gonna get three little acres. They do all the technical stuff. I don't do it, and I would never presume to do it, you know? But I'm also their eyes and ears in the vineyard. If I see things, if I notice something, because I'm over here every day. If I see something that looks wrong or if, a, you know, the problem here or there that I perceive, you know, I'll let them know and then they, they react to it. A lot of the things that, that I do here are the same things uh, that I did when I was pitching, is attention to detail. You get into the clubhouse the first year and you, you, know, you talk to the veterans and you say, what about this and what about that? Where can I improve, etc." cetera? Um, you know, and that's what I'm doing with my winemaker and my vineyard manager. It's, a, it's exactly the same thing. And I'm on a learning curve of this stuff. Skins are crunchy, which is very good. Uh, the, the seeds are browning up. The flavor is terrific. It's about, it's about all I know. <laughs> <laughs> I enjoy the vineyard aspect of it more than the wine. I mean, the wine, the, the, the wine is going to be what it is. It should be really good. You know, it's, it's, in a, it's in a top drawer spot. I just probably give it a little more TLC than other people do. I'm gonna have to hand water these things today or tomorrow.